Hey hey, ici Frankie de Allenkey et bienvenue à la partie 3 de Walking Dead Telltales. Hmm, les 400 jours. Donc on va jouer euh, Shell. Qui doit être une femelle en chaleur. Hein, Puisqu'elle s'enfonce du gâteau dedans le visage. J'ai déjà vu ça. Puis j'ai mal dans le dos encore. Esti. Attendez deux secondes, j'ai le goût de boire un petit peu. Et voilà. Oui. Shell, jour 236. Hey Shell, your sister's getting pretty good, huh? Becca had a good teacher, Steph. Thank you for doing that. She needs something to focus on besides, you know, everything else. Yeah. Growing up in a world like this, what do you think that does to a kid? Change de jeu. She's already changing. She dismisses things she cares about so easily. I guess you kind of have to when you've already lost so much, but I still worry. Becca's a good kid. These are shit times, and she's gonna go through that. But if we can keep her from experiencing some of the shit I've seen... Thanks, Stephanie. Mm -hmm. Thanks. Thanks. Becca, that was great. <laughs> Thanks, sis. You think we can do something like this every week? Um... That sounds like a great idea. Maybe we can all get in on it, like some kind of weekly talent show. That was amazing, Becca. We could all use a little more music in our lives. Did I ever tell you that I used to play in a band? Yes, Roman. You've told us. She doesn't want to hear about it again. All right, all right. In that case, let's get back to work. Ça oh, and thanks to place. Boyd's hard work on the vegetable mm. garden, we're having fresh soup tonight. Okay, let's get to it. You want to help me and Shell do the supply inspection? Cool. You check the flashlights this time. I'll look over the guns. Cool. I don't think so. prudent. Okay, but be careful. People's lives depend on those. We can't have them screwing up because we got lazy. Shell, when you get a sec, meet me out back. Help me feed the watchdogs. Sure thing. Okay. Pistolet. How are we doing on ammo? Better than we thought. We haven't had to use these for a while. Mm -hmm. Huh. Still one short. We never found the other flashlight? Nope. Still in the cornfield somewhere, I guess. You guys point. need help? Nah, we got this. Right, Becca? You go ahead and help Roman out back. The out diner back looked pretty steakhouse. nice back then. That's because they used to pay people to clean it. Also, not as many dead visitors back then. Dessert. Bacon. What? Nothing. Okay. Ugh, these knives are looking pretty ragged. Don't worry, they're on our list. Um. Ça. Did you ever find out what happened there? Remember the dead ones Roman found when we first got here? This is where they were. Might have been just sitting in here for months, who knows. They were both shot, but not in the head. Maybe whoever shot them didn't know about that yet. Mm hmm. Le jeu catch, c'est exactement là qu'on a tué justement le... Peut-être que l'ordre peut... que je le joue va changer les choses. À moins... je sais pas. Une supposition. C'est exactement là où, dans le dernier épisode, on a tué... Ben, on a tué que Nate... Hey, Becca. Think we should start charging for the inspections we make? Oh, yeah. Then we can spend all our money at nowhere. Que Nate, c'est ça, il a tué le... les deux personnes âgées. We should do an inspection on these. Make sure they all work. 
Non, on s'en calisse. Les chances que le feu pogne dans de quoi qui est éteint pis qu'il n'y a pas de. <coughs> d'électricité. C'est étrange. <coughs> Machine à café. <coughs> Pourquoi This je peux faire ça? Ça n'a pas été God, what I wouldn't give for a cup of coffee in the morning. C'est sûr. On va faire refaire le tour. S'il n'y a rien. Euh. Soup. Smells good. Ok. Un évier. Glad we thought to bottle our water before it ran out. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Employees only. Y'a rien ici. Hop, bot de cartel. I don't miss going on raids for this stuff. Oh, starting to thin out in here. Thank God we have a garden now. Okay. <gasps> oh, you scared me! He's hungry. Guess he knows it's feeding time. C'est le vieux. C'est le même vieux. What the fuck? It's not an animal, ça me fait pitié. It's not an animal, Roman. Well, it's not human either. Not anymore. You know, uh, your sister said she wouldn't mind doing this. Roman, we've talked about this. Becca doesn't need to deal with this kind of thing. Listen, I know you think that giving her an easy life is what's best, but it's really not. This is far from an easy life, Roman. You know what I mean. She needs to know the sacrifices we have to make to survive in this world. As long as she knows how to protect herself, it's fine. I don't want her to stop caring about people. Okay. What's that one eating? Hmm. I don't know. I'll check it out. I gotta get back out front. Looking forward to that soup. She and Gals in fucking Yay City. The zombie. Never like a parler à mort vivant. What the fuck? N'importe quoi. Oh, God. C'est quoi? Ugh. Un petit chien, mais ça va l'air d'être une poupée. Qu'est-ce que parle là? Ben... Intéressant, mais j'ai rien à faire ici. Brock. Ok, ben c'est ça. Je sais même pas pourquoi on les nourrit. C'est n'importe quoi. Ah! Oh, Jesus, don't ever fucking do that again! Whoa! What's your problem? I do this all the time. Tu risques de sortir les gens, sur les gens. <rire> I'm sorry, it's it's just the watchdogs. I guess they found a a puppy. Mm. A puppy? Yeah. I guess it just got to me. You know, it was it was so little. You don't mm. think about babies anymore, but after a while, you just kind of accept this is it. Yeah, I guess you kind of forget. <laughs> forget right. what? But then, you know, there it is. You see it and you want to protect it and... And now it's gone. Mm -hmm. That sucks. Was it the old man or the old woman? They're both kind of gross. Mm -hmm. Maybe if Clive dies next, we can put him out there instead. He'd make a better watchdog than those old people anyway. Becca. Shell, Becca! Something's going on outside! What is it? I don't know, something bad. We gotta find Roman. Roman. Come here, everyone! Shit. Come on, we gotta find Roman. Let's mop them. If so, care we were. Jesus! Largum. La My God! Largum. What did you do? All I did was put on the blindfold and bind his wrists. Somebody else beat him up. 
You already had the cuts and bruises. Watchdogs mm -hmm. caught him trying to steal supplies. Is he bitten? No, they didn't get that close. Did he hurt anyone? No, thank God. Who is he? I don't know, and I don't think he speaks English. I can't believe he just snuck it's in. The second break-in we've had in the last couple of weeks. Last time we couldn't catch him, and they got away with more medicine than we could afford to lose. Well, we all know what it's like trying to survive out there. He just came in here for food. Let's just give him some and send him on his what way. What if there are more of them? He could have been scouting. That's right. He could be part of a larger group. If there were more, I think we would have seen them by now. I mean, nobody travels alone by choice anymore, right? Boyd's right. We should just let him go. Why? Look at the poor bastard. We've all done the same thing trying to survive. We don't have to be responsible for him, but we can give him some food and let him take his own it's chances. It's not about his chances. It's about ours. What's to stop him from coming back and armed next time? We could always use more hands keeping the place secure. Boyd, we don't need any more people here. And look at him. How is he He gonna... can't even speak English. This group works because we know how to communicate. Mm -hmm. this, no. raison. <sighs> Maybe you're right. I'm not trying to be a, a bitch. But we have to be smart. Well, he's not staying here. You let in a stranger, and everything starts breaking down. The last time we did that, we lost Bree. And then Vernon with that goddamn oh. boat. Vernon and the boat are the reason the group fell apart. Vernon. Not trusting strangers. Vernon was out for the boat the whole ça, on time. Vu, bien oui. And the second they left that boat unattended, we just stole it. That's when our group fell apart. He can't yes. stay here. I agree. Keeping him here is not an option. In his condition, he'd be a drain on our resources. Look, we all know what we're talking about here, so let's stop dancing around it. We either let this guy go and take our chances, or we kill him. You're right. It's gotta be one or the other. Mm -hmm. We're letting him go. It's the only right thing to do. I'm telling you, we can't do that. But killing him? Is that really the answer? Stephanie, Boyd, you two don't think we should kill him. We know where Joyce and Clive stand on the subject. You're the swing vote here, Shell. What's it gonna be? Lily We have to set him free. We can't! He's not even armed! We can't just kill him! This isn't in self-defense! Isn't it, though? Dang. If it means he can't come back to hurt us? That isn't the same thing. But last time... Joyce, that was a long time ago. If we kill this man, then we're giving up a part of ourselves that we can never get back. Hmm. I'm not well, ready to let that no. go. That way... Cut him free. I hope you guys know what you're doing. Oh, Give him some food. When, three or four cans. Just as a gesture of good faith. And get him out of here. I don't know if you can understand a word I'm saying. But you better understand this. You came this close to death today. And if you ever, ever come near this place again, or tell anybody where we are, you wish you had died today. Mm-hmm. Ça va? Je pense pas avoir fait un mauvais choix, là. Anyway, les épisodes sont courts. Jour 259, ok. C'est peut-être l'épisode le plus long qu'il y aura. Je sais pas. Do you have any fours? Tu as des quatre? Hein? Il joue aux quatre? Nope. Do you have any sevens? Yep. Mm -hmm. I miss playing guitar for everyone. It was stupid, but fun. It was stupid. Why don't we do that anymore? Jean, Since the attack, guitar. there's a lot we don't do anymore. We it shouldn't have let that guy go. Boyd would still be alive and everything would be the same. Boyd agreed it was the right thing to do. Anyway, Roman's obsessed with keeping this place secured now. 
boy, no, I'm supposed to keep... You know that's impossible, right? Well, after last time, Roman isn't taking any chances. And I should fix the loose board behind the storage lots. Becca, are you sneaking out again? Did anyone see you leave? No, no one saw me. You've got to stop doing that. You're going to get us both in a lot of trouble. I don't see why it's such a big deal. We had another break-in just last month. Uh, Becca, you know what it means if someone were to see you and follow you back here. No one is following me. There's no one else out there. Shell, I need to talk to you. Mm -hmm. It's open. <clears throat> What's going on? Hey, Becca. Hey. When you uh, get a sec, I need you to come out and talk to me. It's important. Okay. Okay. I'll be outside. You'll see me. What about Becca? Then in a minute. Give us a minute. Yeah. Just don't take too long. What was that all about? Take it, boo. S'il savait pour les planches. Maybe he found out about the boards? Shit. You think so? If he did, I won't say anything. But hmm. you better stay away from there for a while. Okay. Stay here. It'll be just a minute. I'll fill you in when I get back. C'est tellement comme une émission, là. C'est n'importe quoi. C'est super bon. J'espère que vous aimez ça. Pour ceux qui peuvent aimer Walking Dead. Parce qu'il y en a plein qui aiment pas ça, mais yeah, c'est vos choix. Je peux pas décider de ce que vous aimez. How come no one's watering these? Let's go. Unfinished painting. Effectivement, c'est pas terminé. Terminé. Hop. You. Putain, le gars, c'est. C'est pas le gars qui s'appelle Boyd. Joyce, do you know what's going on? I don't know if I should say anything. Please, what is it? They caught Stephanie stealing and then trying to escape. Oh my god. Stephanie? What huh? are they gonna do? I don't know. What can we do? I'll go talk to Roman. We'll figure it out. Qu'est-ce qu'elle gagnerait à essayer de se sauver? C'est complètement stupide. T'es bien plus fort en groupe que tout seul. Roman? Good, you're here. I heard about Stephanie. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. What are you gonna do? You know what we do. What happened? We caught her trying to escape. But they do? Yeah, no. Well, so what, Roman? Ever since the incident, this hasn't been an easy place to live in. If she doesn't want to stay, let her take her chances out there. Well, A, she had most of our seeds, medicine, and ammo with her. And B, you know we can't let anyone leave who knows where we are. She screwed us, Shell. All of us. And now we're in that position again where we can't keep her here and we can't let her go. You do know why I'm telling you this, right? Yeah. You want me to take care of it. You and Boyd were the ones who fought to let that guy go. Convinced us all to take that chance. Well, we did. And it was wrong. And now Boyd is dead. We're beyond the luxury of taking chances Boyd's now. Right and I if need you're... to know that you're with us a hundred percent. Let's talk to her first. See if we can talk some sense into her. No. She tried to sneak out and leave us without any medicine or extra ammo. She knew that could mean the death of any one of us. If we give her a second chance, she might not try to leave so quietly. You got your gun? It's in the mm. camper. I'll give you a few minutes to get your head together. Hey, blue long oh God, what do I tell Becca? So it's up to you. Whatever you say, I'll back you up. Ça aurait peut-être dû être le dernier que j'aurais fait. Mais en tout cas, c'est pas grave. Shell? What's wrong? Am I in trouble? 
Il n'y a pas à s'inquiéter. Si t'as fini à tenter de s'échapper, il va pas être facile pour toi d'entendre ça. Non. On va dire direct. C'est Stephanie. Elle a stole un bunch of supplies et a tried to escape. Oh my god. What the hell did she do that for? Roman says we have to... Kill her? Yeah. Why would she do this to us? La peur c'est tout, elle a fait une erreur, parce que cet endroit n'est plus sûr. Because this place isn't safe anymore. After those guys attacked us, even after we let their friend go, this place just hasn't been the same. Of course not. Roman's trying to make it better. Better? No one is happy anymore. We live mm. like prisoners. But it's safe here. I mean, yeah, I want to get away every now and then, but I would never leave. That's crazy. Roman wants me to do it. I'm sorry. Uh, let's just get it over with. Your gun's over there, in the drawer. Are you okay? Do you want to talk about it? No, I don't. I just want to get it over with. You know, we don't have to do this. We can just go. What? Hmm? We've survived on our own before. If we just go, we can be out of here before anyone can do anything about it. Are you crazy? Where would we go? There's nothing out there. As long as we're here, we're safe. The group will protect us. But for how long? I don't know. Longer than we'd survive out there. Besides, you know the rules. If we try to leave, Roman will hunt us down. We don't have a choice. This is who we are now. I don't want this Boy. to be who we are. Just let me do it then. Yeah, busy. Fine. Go ahead. No! Mm -hmm. Roman said he wants you to do it. I'll do it when it's my turn. Mm -hmm. This really sucks. Yeah, it does. It's time. I don't mm. ever want to put you in danger. If that means this is what we have to become, then it is what it is. Mm-hmm. Ah ouais, tabarnak. Des fucking scènes longues avec rien dedans. C'est long. Ah ouais, Bruce Sorry. Willis. Me too. Allez. Bon. L'épisode doit être fini. 24 minutes, c'est en masse. Oh. <coughs> fait que merci d'avoir regardé la partie 3. <coughs> The Walking Dead <coughs> Tell Tales. <coughs> Les 400 jours. <rire> On se revoit dans la prochaine partie. Merci beaucoup. Ciao!